It's week 10, it's the Cheltenham Festival, 29 races over three days. Uh, we kick off with the Supreme Novices Hurdle as usual, the two mile and a half a furlong grade one for all the older, older novices. The top one is Argira for Darren Thompson, Kingdom, All Island, Joshua Sutherland, Ashara Blitz for Darren Thompson, Pearly King, Martin Lidham, Seven Spanish Angels, Ryan Tamasevi, Sierra Messiah for Craig Allen, Yorkshire Rock, David Hooley, Duhast, Leon van Rensburg, Enemy of State, Paul Rhodes, First Royal, David Hooley, Gallant Zara, Craig Allen, Kingdom of Whiskey, Joshua Sutherland, and Remix, Diane, Ryan Costello, Tessery Flores, Alex Cherry, and Zarex for Craig Beckwith. So 15 then, facing the starter for this opening race of the festival, and away they go then, to the roar of the crowd, and they make their way towards the first of the eight flights of hurdles in this first of 29. Race is coming from Presbury Park this week and it's Nashara Blitz who is the early leader with first Royal in the purple jacket in second and Zarek on the outside in third. And towards the back count, Zara, the early back marker as they get to the first of the eight, which they've all successfully got to the other side of. And Nashara Blitz in the purple with the white sleeves in the lead and the different shade of purple for first Royal on the outside is second. Zarex in the dark blue with the white sleeves is third as they come up past the stand for the first time this week and the crowd waving them on as they make their day, way down towards the next flight then and it's Nashara Blitz who has the lead with first one at the centre of the track in second and then Zarex third as they get over the second that will be the last on the next circuit looking towards the back to Sari Flores is the back marker and he's struggling a little bit and I think there might be something to miss with that one because it looks like it's dropping tamely away so Nashara Blitz then is the leader from first Royal in second, and then Zarex is third. Argira has moved through into fourth, then seven Spanish Angels on the outside, and Kingdom of Ireland, and Yorkshire Rock and Duhast. And Kingdom of Whiskey making its way through. The back marker in shot is still Gallant Zara, and Tessery Flores does appear to be some way detached and possibly out of the race. But it's Nashara Blitz the leader then, with first Royal second. And Zarex third, then a gap of about two or three lengths to Argira and seven Spanish Angels as they get over to third, which they've all successfully got over. And Nashara Blitz leads by a bet, a length and a half, two lengths to first Royal second. Zarex is third, that's been pretty much the same all the way. Argira, stable companion to the leader, is in fourth. Then come Duhast and Yorkshire Rock after that one, then seven Spanish Angels and Kingdom of Ireland get a little bit closer. Kingdom of Whiskey. He's close up to that one, and then Enemy of State is after that as they get over number four, and that's the midway point of the jump in that's done then now. And the Shara Blitz as they race uphill leads to first row second. Zarex is still there on the outside in third. Duhast is now making a forward move coming through into fourth. Then Kingdom of Whiskey and Argyri. Yorkshire Rock is next. Kingdom of Ireland. Then Seven Spanish Angel just lost its place a little bit. Enemy of State next. Then Gallant Zara and Sierra Messiah as they get over the fifth. And towards the back, Pearly King and Remix Die haven't really got into it at all yet. Tessery Flores does appear to be catching them up. But it's Nashara Blitz who's the leader then as we change angles with first row just about a length back in second. Kingdom of Whiskey on the inside has now moved into third. Argira four and Duhast just hitting a bit of a flat spot there as Yorkshire Rock comes up on its inside. The one widest on the track there is Seven Spanish Angels and Kingdom All Ireland is now coming through to challenge as well as they make their way towards the next end. And it's all beginning to bunch up front as they get over to third from home and now Yorkshire Rock comes to challenge for the lead. Yorkshire Rock has taken it up from Nashara Blitz in second. Then Kingdom of Ireland and Duhast first rules after that one. Kingdom of Whiskey is still there so Sierra Messiah has plenty not got into it yet at the back but it's Yorkshire Rock back in front of they get over the second last. It's Yorkshire Rock over there's a four and their first Royal's gone, so Yorkshire Rock's in the lead from Duhast, who's now the big challenge it's between these two, Kingdom of Ireland is back in third, then comes the Shire of Blitz and Kingdom of Whiskey, they're racing down towards the final flight in the opening race of the Cheltenham Festival, and it's Yorkshire Rock on the inside, Duhast on the outside, these are clear of Kingdom of Whiskey, who's finishing well over the final flight, they go, and Kingdom of Whiskey is now putting a big spurt on the outside, just come through the challenge, it's Yorkshire Rock on the inside, Kingdom of Whiskey now sweeping up the hill, and takes it on the line, Kingdom of Whiskey has taken it and it looked as though the leading pair had got it between them and then Kingdom of Whiskey absolutely flying at the death and has just got up to take it I think from Yorkshire Rock indeed it has Yorkshire Rock was second Kingdom of Whiskey the winner for Joshua Sutherland Yorkshire Rock for David Hooley second Duhast was third for Leon Van Rensburg and the Shara Blitz for Darren Thompson was fourth with Gallant Zara run on to be fifth for Craig Allen, so the festival nerves are immediately quelled at the Joshua Sutherland stables in as that's the one, the first one on the board, that's the one everybody wants the first one.